raise hand function. Go ahead, Mitchell Forty. Hey, Martez, uh, Kentucky ran for you know, 340 yards. I guess just what, what kind of went into some of the, the issues that led to that? Uh, I mean, people just not executing, you know, people not in the right gaps. That's about it. Yeah. I feel like we did pretty well tackling today. It was just execution and gap, gap integrity wasn't there. I think so. oh, that's, that would be my answer to that. Eric Blum. Hey, Martez, it was about the third quarter when you guys had back-to-back -back drives where you made Kentucky punt. Was there anything you changed in there that got those results for you? No, we just we just didn't start fast, you know. Uh, then we found our rhythm, but, you know, we put our offense in a bind. We didn't step up in the biggest moments that we needed to, you know. And that's something that, as a captain, you know, I need to go back and see how I can improve on that in the season. You know, it's week two, so. Hopefully we can get it. We will get it fixed. Andrew Kaufman. Hey, Martez, just what did you think of the way your team battled back uh, time after time in this one, especially right at the end of the, the first half? Uh, yeah, I mean, it means a lot to me just to see the guys fight, you know, on the road. You know, it's a tough place to fight. Uh, just wish we could have done more. And Mike Reeves. Martez, did they do anything at all different than that you might have expected or seen on film coming in? No, just uh, like I said, we didn't start fast. We didn't execute early. And then you look up and it's 14-0, you know, and uh, offense got us back in the game multiple times. Defense didn't step up, you know, and let them get away, let them slip, let it slip away. So, yeah. And a final question from Mitchell Forty. Martez, how important were the, the two takeaways from JC just to keep you all in the game? Uh, super important. You know, he's really uh, stepping into his role and he's becoming a great player for our defense. A lot of fun to play next to him. Uh, yeah, nothing but positive things to say about JC. Thanks. We'll be right back with Case Cook, our final player.